up guys, Mr. Second Passport here. Today I'm going to show what you should do when the airlines require you to get a COVID test maybe before boarding their plane to travel internationally, right? A friend of mine just came down to Ecuador and just flew back to the U.S. with what we're looking at right here. It's an at-home COVID test by Abbott Labs, publicly traded company and she got it for 30 bucks right around 30 bucks and she brought it with her down to ecuador and she could not open the box until she takes the test so you have to keep it boxed and then what 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 you do is you video you start a video call with this company and then in front of them you open the box and give yourself the test in the nose right it's a swab or maybe a mouth as well mouth swab and then you get the results immediately and the airlines accept it uh, an airline like delta or whoever who she just flew with last night here entering april 2022 to go back to the u.s now obviously this is a much better way to get a covid test done quick than uh, trying to find a place to, in like in ecuador here locally and for whatever reason here in ecuador there's this there's kind of a problem with a lot of false positives and you could get stuck here, right, by people doing tests. And also, you know, <clears throat> sometimes you might get charged more than the $30 you'd pay for this. And there's just a whole bunch of reasons. But the biggest reason to avoid doing a test in Ecuador is because unlike the, I've done tests in both the, both the U.S. for COVID and down here in Ecuador. And in Ecuador, they don't let you do it. They, they really take their job seriously down here and they'll, they'll grab your head, shove it back and stuff that thing, stuff that thing way up in there. Like I, you know, I, a tear came down, you know, when they did it to me, you know, they, they got a tear out of me and I've heard from friends once that they got blood out of someone else that I know. So, I mean, they stick that thing way up there and you know, how safe can that be? Uh, I don't know, but it's worth avoiding if you can. So anyway, to avoid locally done tests, I recommend uh, bringing this thing, uh, this home test down from the state sealed that you can do in front of them with uh, over the internet with a video call. And the airlines accept it, right? So again, it's a uh, way, way more convenient way to get your COVID test done than one down here locally, especially for short trips abroad, uh, you might consider uh, buying and bringing something like this from Abbott Labs. I'm Mr. Second Passport. If you like this, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button below. Take care.